I want to show you a simple example of the table import process in Dynamics GP. This is a good way to get some simple information in the GP, especially if you have a large volume of it, because it's very fast. So for my example, I'm going to use the customer vendor relationship table, and I'm going to import data from Excel into that table. This helps set up the process where you can transfer credit balances on your customer accounts over to accounts payable so that you can issue a payment to your customers. So what I want to do is I'm going to set this up in the customer vendor relationship table right here. And what I need to do is I need to create a relationship between my customer ID and my vendor ID. So to do that, I start with my source data. I have that in Excel here where I've created a column with all my customer numbers and the vendor IDs to which I want to match them. Now I'm going to save that as a CSV file. So I have my source file. Now let's go into table import. And the easiest way to get into it is to go to the window into which you want to import data and then go to tools, integrate, and table import. This brings up a screen that shows you all the tables behind that window. It makes it a lot easier to identify and get to the table you want to import data into. Now with table import, you can only import new data. You're not going to be able to update any data or delete data or change data. So let's take a look at it. What we're going to do is we're going to select the customer vendor maintenance here. And I've already set up a definition ID. Let's take a look at that. It's very simple. I'm just adding the customer number and the vendor number to this particular table. I referenced the source file right here. It's a common delimited file. Now I'm just going to import it. And there's about 107 records here. It went pretty fast. You can see that. Now let's go back to that screen. You can see that all those values have been imported into the table. So this is a very simple example of the table import functionality in GP. But if you have a lot of data and it's relatively simple, it's very fast. Thank you.